The demolition exercise undertaken by the Kano state government has been drawing actions from various quarters. The latest is this peaceful protest by some concerned youth. Taken to the streets with black hats and banners, the protesters urged the state government to halt the ongoing demolition exercise. This demolition has cost our people a lot. Many have lost their jobs and businesses are seriously affected. The demolition is not good for the development of Kano State. What do they want our children to do since they have demolished their shops? This has to stop. Earlier, another group had come, taken to the street in support of the actions of the governor. According to them, this is what is needed to clean up the metropolis. I would like to congratulate all our commissioners. Incidentally, Governor Abba Kabir chose to inaugurate his cabinet today. One of the first he did after that is to set up a committee of inquiry to listen to complaints before any further actions taken. We have set up a committee of inquiry. All we are waiting for is for the swearing in of the commissioners. And if it is done, so we are expecting them to start listening to the complainers. They will advise us on how best to handle the matter. No time to delay. The committee is set to commence its work immediately. The, the, the committee cannot take off without the executive council. So it just has like a draft. So now that the executive council is formed, so maybe um, it will be brought to the executive council for the deliberation, necessary correction and so on, or is improvement, then it will, tell, it will take um, the course of action. The announcement of the committee of inquiry has brought a sense of relief to the owners of the buildings marked for demolition. Sadiq Ilyasu, Channel's Television News.